Hey guys, it's Ben back for your 19th Java tutorial, and today we're doing methods with parameters. So you see here, on this one, it's setting the health to zero. Okay? But in here, there's nothing inside of it. So what we could do is kill all players, and then inside of these parameters, a number to what we want to set their health to, or a number in the config. So we could get the config, and get the options, uh, not options even, and get int, and we're going to create an int in a minute called health, okay? And then we've got to create a method, um, kill all players, uh, players, players, int, int1, like that. So the int is equal to whatever is in this config, and we can use that. Oh, we could just call that X because I don't like it being anything else apart from X. So if we copy um, that, everything inside there, so we're doing the exact same thing, but we're not setting the health to zero. We're setting the health equal to X, and X is equal to whatever is in these parameters when you use the method. So when we use the method kill all players, it's going to look for what's in here and it's going to get the int that is health with a capital H. Now, you're thinking maybe. Oh, well, these are the same. Why would it not get an error? Because if you make two methods when they're named the same, then it counts them as a different method if they have more than one int or more more than one uh, if, if if they have a parameter inside of them. Um, so like that. So what we can do is we can go into our config and we can do and I need to change something. Um, so instead of opening with I want it to open with um, this is something you should do, you should go download uh, notepad++ because it is a lot easier to understand I'll be right back, I'll just okay, so that's what's set up, so I open all my uh, files in notepad so if I open config it's going to say mtd welcome to our server now health is the one we made and that's let's set this equal to five. Okay, so that's our int five. And let's make a blank line, save that. Uh make sure never to use tabs and stuff in the uh, YML as well. It's a very picky language. Um so what it's gonna do is it's going to let's remove this kill all players, first of all. It's gonna kill all the players with the amount of health that is in the configuration file. So it's it's created a private I don't like that. I've told you why. It's created a public void called kill all players. And it's got the parameters int x in it. Now x is equal to what's ever in the parameters. In this case it's whatever is in the health part of the config. So it's gonna list all the players, get the history for the players, and then just set the player's health equal to whatever is inside there. So let's refresh everything. Export next. Yep. Um, start my server. Now, if I go into my plugins folder, let's wait that that's loaded. Um, let's go into my config. It's going to have the health there. So, I'll be right back in the game with. Ah, uh, hello. Um, so if I do right, there's, there's Noi here as well. Uh, so if I do kill all. It's going to set everyone's health, I think, to 5. So, did, did he not, yeah, good, see? Okay. Oh, wait, no. Uh, survival. Okay, um, kill all. That it should hurt people. Um, just no, I seem to get hurt. Okay, so. Okay, cool. So, um, if I go into plugins, go into the config, go into the config, and set everyone's health to twenty, which is the maximum. Um. And then do kill all. Um. <laughs> uh, 
everyone should have get healed because I didn't get hurt. Notice, but it's, oh. <laughs> um, kill or uh, no one, no one gets hurt. Okay, um, okay, I will hurt you somehow. Um, and I'll teleport him to me. Such a simple name. Alright, cool. So that's just um proof of concept. That that healed me. See? Um It's all it's all helpful. In in the scheme of things. <laughs> yeah. So thank you for watching. And I hope this helped you a little bit. And so Bye.